Hi everybody, I hope you are doing well. At this short video tutorial, we're gonna discuss about one of the most practical families which is doors. Following that, if you wanted to take your skills to new heights, you can enroll now to become a master in the families of Revit via the mentioned link in the caption. So guys, let's begin the session with creating the family of door. First of all, I open the template family of door and then I start modeling the door. Here at first, I can delete the default frames which are placed by default in the template family of the door and then customize the frames. So in create tab, the best technique for creating the frames is using sweep and then pitch path i specify the path by clicking on the lines around the edges by this way then i click on finish then i click on select profile edit profile after that i want to sketch the profile of the door or the frame however we can sketch it in the reference level plan view which is easier however we can move it forward in the 3d view if you want it so i start sketching the profile suppose the profile like this finish as you can see, the swap is created, so you'd better to associate the material here. So I open material browser. I don't want to associate something no special. So let's see. Since I don't want to waste my time in this short video tutorial, I name it frame for example. In the other settings about the material, I specify the color. Well done to distinguish it better. And as you know, you'd better to create a family. I mean to create a parameter after associating the material to the frame by click on associate family parameter and then here i should specify a name for my new parameter which is associated to the material so this would enables you to control the material of the frame in the project and for modeling the panel of the door the best approach here is to use the nested families for using for creating the panel so let me open the proper template family file a separate family file which is generic model by this way right now here at this template file i'm gonna model the panel like by using extrusion tool and then i click on finish very well then i should associate the required parameters to the extrusion i measure the distances then i associate them to the parameters i prefer to specify meter for unit i choose meters and then the rounding to decimal places well done then i associate the dim dimension to the parameter which is wide to control the width of the panel in the project Panel wide, well done, okay. And then I can strain the side of the extrusion to the reference plane. And I should check the other side since it should be constrained, so I make sure. And as you know, we can control the thickness of your extrusion or the panel. But note that you should set the or adjust the height of the panel too. So I measure the distance of the height to associate it to a new parameter named height. I name it panel height as you can see on the screen in type properties well done then i connect the extrusion to the reference plane and then i can strain it well done then it's time to associate the material of the panel i duplicate to create a new type or the new material to associate it to the panel panel as you can see or panel material then i so specify the color like brown okay apply then i want to associate the material to a new parameter in order to be able to control the material but in the project i name it panel okay well done and then i save the family file as um for example panel well done saved and then I should load it into the project. Right here, I place it in the door family template file. Right now, I should place the panel between these two frames as you can see on the screen I'm pinpointing. So I should sketch two reference planes to adjust the size of the panel by this way very well and then i can strain them or align them by this way as you can see very well let me measure the distance here as you can see in both sides these two should be equal to each other and locked since the distance should be fixed then i should open family types and create a new parameter for calculating the opening width in which the panel is going to be positioned so how do we can um compute the value of opening wide so in the formula i define wide at first and i want to subtract it from 50 50 is the total of 225 um, meters i'm in millimeters i'm sorry then i select them in type property i associate the panel wide to the opening wide 
well done so i can position the panel between the frame then i should align the panel from one side well done let's check the parameters in family types i modify the value of white like 2000 okay as you can see they are working correctly but here we should align the panel with the horizontal preference plane check this out unlocked so just in case if we modify the thickness of the wall this would affect on the thickness of the panel too let's check it out guys as you can see they are matched to each other but here i should reduce the value of thickness of the panel let me check it since the consider dimension or size is 35 millimeters here in edit family i specify the size not 0 0.0 to 35 and then i click on ok i save the file and then reload it into the project let's check it out in the 3d view but we should adjust the height after adjusting the width of the panel since we got the frame around the panel as you can see following that we should create a new parameter naming it as the opening height first of all i should sketch the reference planes then i measure the distance which is 40 well done then i create a new parameter i name it opening height as i told you before well done okay then i want to define a new statement for the opening height formula first of all i define height then i subtract it from 40 millimeters actually check this out very well i select the panel and in edit type i associate the panel height to the opening height very well let's check it out in the 3d view mm, great i'm gonna test the parameters in the family types for example for the opening wife i reduce it 80 then for the height for example 2200 check this out everything is okay they are working correctly and if you select the panel in edit type you can specify a new material for the panel you can modify it or you can remove it or whatever for example i specify a new color for the panel to have something new check this out and here is the result check it out in 2d view and the last part of the process is to adjust the reference level plan view in this stage or at the final stage we're going to use the symbolic lines i pick symbolic line and then i start sketching it check this out by this way actually i'm gonna put importance on the symbolic line of the opening or the 2d drawings of the door of the or of the panel as well as the opening so i should measure the distance here check this out by this way like this and then i associate this to a new parameter opening wide check this out let's continue if you agree let's uh test the parameters for wide for example 1200 let me move the dimensions to check the symbolic line it is working correctly and finally i should or sketch an arc check this out from here I specify the point then i sketch the arc by this way and then again as testing the parameters now that i should test the parameters after associating them to the dimensions well done it's time to load it into the project and then we will test it again so i load it at first by this way as you are concerned you can earn money by creating families and sharing them with others for instance you can model multiple products of a company by imitating from the catalogs and then sell them so as a result there are millions of job opportunities for creating families in architectural industry let's get back to the project here i got a wall as you can see then i place the created wall just created i mean no that i should definitely modify the type of the wall and test it to make sure that they are working correctly and if you wanted to hide the panel in the plan view you can open the edit family as you can see select the panel then in visibility settings you can uncheck the plan rcp so then it would be hidden let me load it and then override the existing version so it is hidden so guys if you're interested in creating professional families so do not miss out on this opportunity to become a skilled family creator